Restless days like these bring back memories. This bar would be one of many places me and my brother Trent would go to escape after a long day of work. We'd drink like there was no tomorrow. About a week ago, his body was found collapsed in the middle of his living room. Medical declared that it may have been natural causes, but I don't believe so. This investigation became personal very quickly. He was the only person I considered to be family. Even as I drank away, my mind began to dart towards a woman. A woman with elegant features. The name's Sullivan, Harold Sullivan, and I'm an aspiring private eye, and on this fateful evening, I met Linda. I suppose so. That is a ridiculous meal you've got there. Tastes good enough. I'm sure it does, but what kind of man sits alone at a bar only eating french fries? Well, I'm the kind of guy that doesn't have a lady around to make those decisions for him. Can I have one? Have we met before? Someone like me? You got a name? Linda. Linda Mosley. And you? You're Harold Sullivan. That's right. So, what is a good looking guy like yourself doing in a rat infested bar? They've got rats? <laughs> well, I don't know, but. I wouldn't be surprised if they did. What, are you afraid of rats? No. Mm. No, of course not, but... About me being alone, I think it's because I struggle to take off my detective lenses around civilians. Yeah, I think I've heard enough of that. I want to hear more about your rat phobia. <laughs> Bartender! What is this anonymous delight? It's a, a mystery dessert. I'll have one of those. On it. Though I didn't recognize her, I felt like we'd crossed paths before. For a stranger, she sure did like to talk. There was something more to her that I just couldn't read. My brother used to call me Harry. Used to? He, um... He got sick. 
I'm sorry, I, I didn't mean No, to. don't be. I said I wouldn't get upset about it anymore. Have you ever shot a man? I, I, I'm s Don't answer that. Um, my mother tells me I have a problem with speaking before thinking. Would you agree? I wouldn't really know. Well, here we are. Do you want to come in? I make a decent cup of tea. I don't know. It's so late and I've already taken up so much of your evening. Well, come in or don't. I don't mind either way. So what do you do? I act. Probably nothing you've ever seen before. I mostly do cat food commercials. Well, uh, I've got a cat. I may have seen you. Oh, nice place you got here. It's all right. How old were you in this one? About 16 or 17. And that's an old boyfriend of yours? Um... That's odd. Harry, I'm terribly sorry for everything I've put you through. I wish it didn't have to end this way. But it's too complicated to explain. Take care of yourself, Linda.